Uh, 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 uh. Drunk driving on a Wednesday with three bitches in the MPV. Time is extremely valuable, and I prefer to waste it. And I also wasted it by recording a whole video about cum and ejaculation before recording this one. Um, it should be uploaded. Anyways, hello, Xavier Fernandez here. I have insulted Wii Sports Me numerous times, but I never really complimented any of them. Favorite Hernandez did, but I didn't. Um, so I decided to dedicate this video to favorites. Also, I put a song in the background for each me. Let's start off with 25. Skip is one of the me versus me's. Also, also, four out of five of the me versus me's are here. We got lower in here, spoiler, but not really. Anyway, Skip is just that dude out of all me versus me. He was my favorite while the server was open. And he has a good design. I imagine Skip has a clumsy idiot me. Anyways, there's nothing else much to say about it. Pavel, shout out to Cherry is Alive, CO Furry, CO Furry. Anyways, Pavel is another one of the me verse gods, gotta love them. He also looks like Pikachu. Yellow Ferrari and diamonds like Pikachu. Anyways, I do imagine better than Electric Me if he was anything. Pavel, for me, is probably one of the most marketable memes because I could put him on every thumbnail I wanted to and still get views. Also, on my Just Dance channel, I put Juliana Herrera in all my thumbnails, so. Go subscribe to Nick Question Mark Xavier. Pavel also has a cool personality as well, has great skill ratings and a good design. Never Die AI is only me. I gave one of my songs in this vid. Everyone, every other song is like copyrighted, so I'm not getting monetized. So. Me and AI had history since 2011, since like black people with sunglasses memes are like my favorites. And she was also one of my favorites because her name was easy to remember with the two letters. She was still my favorite, one of my favorites up until I forgot about Wii Sports. I then came back in August 2019 and she's still one of my favorites. Her design is one of my one of the best in the for all the bees. She gives me Guardian from Steven Universe vibes. Also there are there was someone with AI in their avatar I had interactions with in October 2019. I haven't seen her in a while, but AI is cool and one of my favorites. And Tyrone would have been at number one if this was the year 2012. He was an OG. I always played We Party with him in Balance Bow back then. I don't really remember much about him from 2012, so let's move on. Zio Tong. The daughter of Kiko or Shinosuk, but definitely not both since that's incest. Zio Tong is really only here because of her design, so I'll move on. Joseph has been a favorite of mine since 2013, also being one of the first Wii U Mii's I cared about, along with Barry, Alice, Barbara, Pitt, and Olga, and Enrique. Joseph for me is probably the most one of the most important Mii's on the Wii U and probably in the series. He's in so much art that I like to call him a Nintendo developer at some times. I just don't feel like the Wii U would be the same without him. He's also like the only promotional meet from the GDS days to return on Wii Sports Club. So yeah, whenever Nintendo does stuff like that, I expect to see him on there. Yoko's been one of my favorites since November 2019, purely because back then, I felt like she was just so underrated. I'm not sure about today though. Her skill was, her skill level is so great and her design was also great, but nobody said anything back then. And I see her personality is like, she's never, she's never there, but once she's there, she's there. And kicks ass, bruh. Imagine liking a me because of wiki drama. Anyways, um, let's um, if we go back to earlier 2020 and before, I used to like Marty a lot, but not like top 25 because of her design. She never really harmed me and anywhere. I also didn't play Wii Sports Club that much or Wii Party U ever. Also, I played uh, tennis with her a few times, and she's a good teammate. So for the wiki part, as I like to call. Autumn 2020 and up. Uh, watch my last video. Shout out how I love it. Alberto hates everyone. Maximilian. R.I.P. Max. He died October 10th, 2019. I do have a video to talk about the situation a little more from August. So if you want to know more, just go there. Link in the description. I don't have a full video on him though. Now here's Millie who has one of my personal favorite songs this vid, which is it true? It's one of my personal favorites, but I don't think it's the best song this vid. I'll explain why later on in Millie's explanation. Anyways, for Millie, she is the mascot of Meverse, my second favorite site behind the Wii Sports Wiki, obviously. Sad it closed down so early. People refer to her as London there, which I actually did not know until like 2019 on the Meverse Wiki. Millie is definitely one of my most cared about memes on the Wii Sports Club. Anyways, for London, the song by Travis Scott and J. Cole is one of my favorite songs of all time. First heard in May 2019 and added it to my playlist on August 2019. I heard it a fair amount of times during late 2019, which is when I joined back into the Wii Sports community. So every time I hear London, I think of those times. I also had a few me, me friends who originated from the UK at the time, with its capital being London, the same name of the, with the name of the song. Me, Lucia, and Barbara were some of them I can name. 
So London is one of my favorites for this reason, and it's, it's one of those songs I consider to be a main theme in my life. Nick, and the only reason I like him so much is because of Metopia, to be honest, but also he has a cool design and a cool personality. So yeah, Rhea is one of the most OGs of all OGs. So someone has her PvP affair the wiki. And sure, she's been dead for like two years, but she is still goaded. Has a talk since June 7, 2017, but she's still one of the OGs of OG. The granddaddy of the eSports wiki, which is the truth. So. Back when I was on the wiki for a short while on an account I won't name in 2016 to 17, I've seen her a lot and she was cool. I never talked to her though. Anyways, I imagine Reese's personality is like an internet god and like the person who does all the computer stuff on Wuhu Island and also like a great artist. Kiko, Shinosuke sister from Wii Sports, also a person on the wiki I think it was cool. Most people really like Kiko and she has been one of my favorites since 2009 actually. She never harmed me in anything for a long time and I respect that. And she is also designed well so she was probably in my top 25 for a long time. Shout out to the wiki. She wouldn't be here up at 14 which is really that high without Kiko from the wiki so shout out. Also a lot of bees are up here because because of other people on like social media by the way. Say Young, so if I had a favorite me of the year award, she would definitely win 2016 and 17. Speaking of, uh, this is the chart right here. But anyways, I think Say Young is the best design me on the Wii U. Without a doubt, nobody beats her. I liked her in 2016, 17, specifically because of her design. And I also played baseball and tennis with her a few times, and she's a fun opponent. She's also a cool person, so, so yeah. Lucia has been one of my favorites for a while. Her design is great. And I was friends with uh, Lucia on Discord for a while in autumn 2019, so that's something. Her account got banned, unfortunately, like always. Now there's a new Lucia who's also good. I also like Lucia's skill rating. Zio Gion is Shinosuke's son, star 10 and everything, and is also on the beat for some artwork, which is like three good factors, but so. Also from the Wii Sports Wiki, we got the queen herself, Mizuho. She is great because of her design, and she also has a fire skill level. I like her hair. Anyways, if you're designed well and have a great skill rating, you're one of my favorites because it means you are a very badass. Anyways, also for Mizuho, she's from the Wii Sports Wiki. I also subbed her channel 9 times. She was very cool while she was on there. She hasn't been active since August, so that sucks a little, but still. Harash is an OG. It's Hiroshi. I, I, I say Harash for no reason. The granddaddy of the Wii Sports, he also looks like he could be my grandfather. He also reminds me of my grandfather, that's why I liked him a lot in 2009, and I also played with him a lot of times. He's never stressed me out before, and he's also fun to play against and I like his skill level pretty balanced. Haru is me that everybody loves due to her design, but for me it's beyond her design. Haru has Haru has been a comment section veteran to my vids for a while. She can be seen in my Roasting Weeds video comment section. She's a Discord person also. Hasn't, I haven't really talked to her in months though. There were two of them. I also played Wii Party back for her in 2012. Loved her design and she was also a fun opponent. And she also has a good skill rating. So she is very likable. I need a Rari and Enzo. I'm cycling with Vincenzo. I play cycling all the time though. So I have to be a fan of Vincenzo. I'm a big fan of Vincenzo. I'm a big fan of Vincenzo. XF is a fan of Vincenzo. XF is a fan of Vincenzo. Senzo. Senzo. I need a Rari and Enzo. I need a Benz in my Benzo. I'm cycling with Vincenzo. Senzo. Senzo. I need a Rari and Enzo. I'm cycling with Vincenzo. I'm cycling with Vincenzo. Miguel is an OG. He's been one of my favorites since 2009. First of all, his design is cool. I loved his design back in 2010 and I was always used to playing basketball with him and lose because I fucking sucked. But still, he is also the airplane man of Wahoo Island. He was the man at the grand opening in 2009. I also played swordplay with him a lot because that was the only sport where I was decent enough to get there and got to him in showdown. Not to mention beginner was my favorite class in Wii Party back in 2012. So you know I played with him quite a few. So honestly, I had so much fun with him. And also, air sports exist, so we have history there. Miguel was also my favorite in 2018, because when I played with him a little bit, I played with him a lot. And he's just very fun to play against Wii Sports Resort and to play with, and he's probably one my most played against me of all time. Also, these next four me's are going to be my top me's forever, and that will never change. Barbara from Wii Sports Club. So Barbara, she was always one of my favorites since 2014, but I didn't start caring about her this much until late 2019. The reason I like Barbara so much is because in autumn 2019 and winter 2019 to 20, I had a friend who was Barbara from Wii Sports Club on her PFE in name. And she might have been the biggest Wii Sports nerd of all time. She typed everything with two eyes. She had a lot of fun. she had a lot of knowledge on the game and had a fun personality. So she was a great person. 
and she was very active on Poop server up until January. And she is actually still on Matt's and the Wii Sports Wiki server, but I haven't talked to her in a while since January, so she's probably my favorite Mii Gang member from this vid and I miss her a lot. Also her design reminds me of RDL Sony from Just Dance. Miyu ranks higher than Barbara since I liked her long before, I also knew her long before, but um... Miyu was one of my favorites since 09 and I don't think she's ever ranked outside of my top 10 along with Miguel, Vincenzo. Miyu is one of the most liked Miis in the whole entire Wii because of her design and for me it's way beyond that. Yeah like August 2009, September 17, 2019. Like back then I only liked her because of the design until like September 2019. But then when I found Pufasha server I found Miyu from Wii Sports on there and also Lucia from Wii Sports along with Maximilian and a few others. The big three. Anyways, while Miu was alive, she was a great person and another Wii Sports nerd. Also, you still watch my content. I don't know if she still does. She was always a cool person on Discord with a fun personality and a big Wii Sports fan like me. And she was pretty comical as well. Her account got banned in November and it was pretty sad. I wish she could be here again in the Wii Sports community because she was very cool. Matt from Wii Sports. Where would I be today without Matt from Wii Sports? Where would you be today without me and Matt from Wii Sports? The amount of influence that Matt has is incredible and I don't think Wii Sport, the Wii Sports community wouldn't be the same without Matt and I wouldn't be the same Wii Sports YouTuber I am without Matt. Same goes for the one on Discord, YouTube and his YouTube channel will be in the description. Matt is so important and also with the, without the YouTuber Matt from Wii Sports, I wouldn't be as big as a Sheena Shizuk fan I am today and imagine a uh, Xavier without no Sheena suit. So Matt's channel is goaded as well and he's also the granddaddy of Megan, his Discord server is great. And I don't think I'll be the same human today who I am without him, so Matt from Wii Sports just has to be up here. I also wouldn't be the same human I am without Sheena Suk, who is number one on this list. So Sheena Suk was always one of my favorites in 2019-18 because his design and also his name was very long. It all started on August 25th, 2019, when my debut to me game was officially made. And I decided to be Sheena Suk since better me's were taken or Mii's I thought were better at the same time. Also, I used a randomizer for Sheena Suk, so I changed my Mii to him, and by September, October, the professional server range of my days, he was my favorite. I have now built a personality around him and gave him a YouTube channel. And those are my top 25 favorite Mii's because somebody needed a compliment, and I also really want to use this as a background. Uh, subscribe to Ninquestion Mark Xavier, join my Discord, join the Wii Sports Wiki, and goodbye. <laughs>